This week on Theme Park Bar, we're heading back to Chez Alcatraz to recreate the UOAP exclusive cocktail, the Magi Mule. Coffee. Like the mummy. <laughs> Your souls are mine. Hello, my name is Matt, and welcome to Theme Park Bar. I am a career bartender and an Orlando native who wants to show you how to make the best signature drinks from around the world and across the universe. Here at Theme Park Bar, we know the best attractions are the ones served in a glass. When it comes to showing love to annual pass holders, Universal Orlando really is at the top of their game. Aside from the usual benefits of discounts on select food and merchandise, Universal's really up the ante with UOAP Appreciation Days. So programs start back in 2018 and their select days, weeks, and sometimes even month-long events just giving us some extra perks. There are great deals on hotel rooms, sometimes they even throw in after-hour parties just for pass holders. But my personal favorite is always going to be exclusive cocktails. And that's what this week's drink is, a UOAP exclusive from Chez Alcatraz. Debuting in September of 20 this year, the Magic Mule has very quickly become one of my favorite cocktails in any theme park. It's named after my favorite ride and has two of my favorite liquors mixed with a crisp and spicy ginger beer. It has everything you need to ward off evil spirits or just bad vibes in general. <laughs> Here's what you're going to need. One ounce of bourbon, one ounce of dry gin, half an ounce of lime juice, half an ounce of agave, and top with ginger beer. All right, so let's go ahead and get the Magi Meal working here for you. This is gonna be an incredibly quick and easy drink to put together. It's a drink that we like to say is built in the glass, meaning the glass you're gonna serve it in is gonna be the glass you're gonna mix it in, build it in, built in glass. Pretty easy stuff. So get your serving glass of choice and uh, fill it all the way up with ice like you typically do. Right away, we're gonna start off with one ounce of bourbon. We got one ounce of gin. If you've been watching for a minute, you know that I love me some gin. Actually, Shh, our secret. I'm gonna follow that up with half an ounce of fresh lime juice, and half an ounce of agave syrup. From here, you can just uh, pour the ginger beer in. I like to give it a quick roll in there just to get the juice and the agave mixed up. Completely optional, you can just pour it all in the glass and give it a stir with your straw if you want. From there, we're gonna to top with our ginger beer. Looking at maybe three or four ounces. And lastly, there's a quick slice of orange on there. A mule is traditionally put on with a lime, but that's what they do at Alcatraz. So that's what we're doing here. And that is what's gonna bring you to your Magi Mule. Two, uh, two spirits, two liquors. My personal favorite, bourbon, a dry gin, ginger beer, lime juice, agave. It's a traditional mule, but made with bourbon and gin. Uh, let's go ahead and give this a shot. Actually, I'm gonna throw, in honor of Chez Alcatraz, a shark straw right in there. All right, let's go ahead and give this a taste. Mm. Oh man, I, uh, I love this drink. I said in the intro that it is absolutely one of my favorite drinks in any theme park, and I mean that. That's no bull I'm saying for the show. Uh, when I saw on Twitter that this drink first came out in the beginning of September, I got in my car and I went straight to Alcatraz. I got one of these and I downed it in seconds. It's, I say the word, I say crisp on the show a lot to describe drinks, but this is a very crisp drink. The ginger beer has that nice spice to it. Nice little bite. The fresh lime juice, of course, gin with that great herbaceous flavors that it has in there with the juniper. Very refreshing, very much a summertime drink. It's a great thing about Florida though. It's a great thing about, you know, the curse of the mummy. It takes place in Egypt, right? It's always hot as hell here. It's always perfect for a summertime drink. Mmm. Mmm. Uh-oh. I uh about out here. Hold on, I gotta... The lime! Oh man, I love this drink. The Magi Mule, gin, bourbon, lime juice, agave, 
ginger beer. Very, very simple, very quick and easy to make. Be fantastic. Summertime, fall time, anytime in the sultry heat of Florida, Orlando, Egypt, wherever the hell you might be, this is an amazing cocktail and I highly, highly recommend that each and every one of you try this. Oh. Oh my god, I I love this drink. Hey everyone, as always, thank you so much for joining me here on another episode of Theme Park Bar. If you're new to the channel, become one of my bar regulars to make sure you never miss a sip simply by subscribing and let me know down in the comments below what you like about the show, are you going to try to make the Magi at home, and what cocktails do you want to see me recreate here for you. You can also chat with me all over social media, at Twitter and Instagram, both at Theme Park Bar. You can find all my past videos and recipes, as always, at ThemeParkBar.com. You can follow the link down below to pick up a Theme Park Bar t-shirt to support the show, looking extra stylish. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. It was a quick and easy one this week. Some of the best drinks out there are just that, quick and easy to make. So with that note, when you're going out to please, make sure you're always being safe, you drink responsibly, never forget to tip your bartenders, and don't forget your Magi. As you learned in that Mummy Q video, no Magi, no service. Why don't you get some service? Bring your Magi. No Magi, no service. It's pretty cut and dry, all right? Yes. Cheers.